Tom Garcia, you're running for CD24. Tell me about it. Well, uh, it's a perfect fit for the kind of person I am. Veteran, uh, career leader, a lot of veterans in there uh, in that district. We've got NASA and a lot of seniors also, a lot of retirees. And I understand what, what they're going through right now. I've got two parents that are retired and concerned about seniors issues. So why district. are you actually running in the race? I didn't see anybody get into the race initially that I thought had a chance at beating the incumbent, Suzanne Cosmas, but there have got a, a, there are quite a few more people have gotten in the race, but I still believe that I am a strong front runner in this race because of my career leadership and experience. So do you see yourself as the true conservative in the race? Yes, I am definitely the true conservative and constitutionalist in the race. Let's talk health care. Health care now. This bill obviously is going to pass. Okay, if and when it does pass, and you you fall, if you find yourself in the Congress, would you help repeal it? Would you support the effort to repeal it? Absolutely, I'll be at the forefront of that because I believe this health care reform at the federal level is unconstitutional. They have no constitutional authority to reform health care. So what we will have to do is chip away out with amendments on other bills to kind of take the legs out from this uh, health care bill. And then once we have a good conservative president in the White House again, we can pass a bill that we know won't be vetoed that will repeal the entire thing. Immigration, it's going to be a big issue. It's going to starting in the forefront. Where do you stand on immigration from? Do you accept any, do you, do, you, do you support any form of amnesty? I don't, and here's why. I believe that our citizenship is our most precious treasure in the United States of America. Without it, you don't have anything else. That's, it gives us all of our rights and privileges. So why would we give away our most precious treasure? We don't give amnesty to shoplifters, and they can use the same excuses. They're poor, just trying to provide for the family. We don't let them off the hook. Why would we let somebody off the hook? for citizenship. Someone that steals a pair of pants, we, let up, we're good, we don't let up the hook. Somebody that steals our most precious treasure, no, I'm against that. What about E-Verify? Do you support E-Verify? I do, because I believe that that's one way to ensure that people don't have incentive to come here. If you can't get a job, if you can't get a house, if you can't rent an apartment, you can't get a car, you can't get a driver's license, then you have no incentive to come to the United States of America. And finally, what are you doing here in Orlando at this beautiful Republican Party of Florida quarterly? I'm here to meet wonderful people like you, Javier, <laughs> and do as many interviews like this as possible, and the food and beverage. Sounds good. Hey, Tom, thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Thank you. Take care.